Blitz the Ambassador uh, from my Cross City Gunner. Right here in Bed Stuy, Brooklyn. Chilling. Peace to Africology. It's a pleasure to do this. Uh, when I think about the word hip hop and global, I already think that those two things are intertwined already. Um, hip hop as it stands would not be possible without the global diaspora right. black people as is well documented Kuhert Herc comes from Jamaica right. well first his ancestors come from Africa that's what, you yeah, know what that's I mean right. bring the drum Kuhert Herc is in the, the street jam DJ scene right. brings that culture to the Bronx it takes root in America and it becomes a global phenom it goes back to Africa right you know, so in my mind, I already believe that hip hop is a, is, one, is definitely a true global phenom in that it hops from continent to continent, and I feel it's only right that it comes back to the to the motherland, and right. artists are able to use that same voice that started from out of our culture and has kind of evolved into this beautiful global thing. First, I'll say uh, what it means to be an MC. Um, to be an MC, I, I take very seriously. I believe that we are like the griots that come from uh, West African and or African culture, where a lot of history, a lot of information is stored mm -hmm. in the spoken word and kind of transferred from generation to generation. So to be an MC is a very, very, very high honor and prestigious thing because we're continuing the culture of a griot. If you want to know what's going on, or what went on in 1992, 93 in the world in terms of, you know, or even the 80s in terms of economics and all that. Right. You can play a hip hop record and you will know what happened. You know what I mean? Based on the fact that these guys really documented all this information. To be an African MC is an even special uh, uh, privilege because, you know, now you're taking, now we're directly connected to the griot. You know what I mean? And we're continuing this culture um, that has always been around. You know what I mean? And now the MC is, has become, the African MC is the new griot. You know, and a lot of us are spitting in our native languages and, you know, becoming more and more like we're exporting this idea and culture. And that's naturally taking root in a lot of different places and we're storing cultural information and disseminating cultural information right, for the young ones coming up. So. Yeah, man, it's a true honor to be to be an African MC. That's what. Well, Africology. <laughs> well, I'll talk about the psychology of Africa. That's what I think about. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Africology is all the things that are African: the thought, the ideas, the mindset. Right. You know what I mean? And I feel like uh, Africology is the one true capture of where the African is at mentally. Uh, our psychology, like I said, you know what I mean? Our thought process. Right. Um, so yeah, that's, those are the things that come to mind when I think of, when I hear the word Africa. Going for the first time to Europe uh, to tour with my band, the MZ Ensemble. I start in Brie, Belgium. I play. Um, Paris, I played Berlin, I played Cologne, I played, actually, I played three dates in Germany. Um, and I had a London show that unfortunately got canceled, but I'm working on getting another show in London. I'll be stopping in Amsterdam to do some press, I'll be stopping in Paris to do some press. So it's definitely a big deal for us um, as a band. We know that our reach is global, and it's only right that we take the music to our fan base and our family that's out in the world. Um, another thing too is I recognize that there is a huge African uh, audience. Audience, uh, well, immigrant Africans that right. are living in Europe, and um, you know that that's the audience that I sp you know I speak to as well. And so I really I'm focused on trying to reach them and and, and helping me get to their native lands. Um, so it, it is definitely a big deal for us uh, going out to Europe for the first time. Go, go, go.
It's the ambassador Respect. of ecology. Yes. Artists. Yo, this is directly from my people back home. You can do it. You know what I mean? You can get out here and your voice can't be heard because talent is talent. And no matter where you're from, if you bring it and it's true from the heart, you will be respected. No matter what language it is in, no matter what vibe you're bringing, you can even bring instruments like this. Once it's from the heart, it's going to be felt. 